Hello, here's a quick little video to show you guys how to access your weekly exercise log and how to fill it out. So once you're in Google Classroom, you're gonna wanna click on your special area or PE classroom. Once you're in here, you're gonna wanna click on classwork up at the top. And under do this week, you'll see weekly exercise log. So let's click on that. And you can see here, uh, you can click on it right away or you can click on view assignment. And I'm gonna click on this doc. Once you click on this document, it's going to copy one of these just for you. So every, everyone in the class will have their own copy and you can edit it on your own. These are gonna be up to 20 points. And for your assignment, you should complete at least 90 minutes of activity or more. And you can set a goal for yourself if you would like to do more than that. Personally, I set a goal to be active every single day of the week. And so you can put your name up here, the date, and start thinking about what activities you want to do, and then you'll log them on the log. If you're confused about what you should do, if you look at the second page, there are some ideas here for you. There's links to a couple different YouTube workouts. The Little Sports YouTube is a channel with a bunch of videos. Some of them are very new. You can use Go Noodle, Dance with TikTok. Here's a link to a yoga YouTube channel. We Sports, Just Dance, and then there's a bunch of different sports, recreational activities, and other. So if you need some ideas on what to do, feel free to look through that. Going up here to the log. So let's say on Monday, you do a yoga class online. Then you're gonna fill out how much time that took, let's say 30 minutes. Right here, you're gonna put somebody who can verify that you do that activity. So maybe that was a parent and then they can sign it or you can put their name, Mrs. Moore. All right, so that's what I did on Monday. I already have 30 minutes acti of activity. This line up here at the top is just an example of what the form might look like when you fill it out. So let's say Wednesday, maybe I went, um, took a walk with my dog for 20 minutes. And let's say my grandparent Can verify that and their name is Mr. Moore. Okay and then let's say Thursday you did dancing for 45 minutes. So right now at this point I'm already over 90 minutes which is fine. Maybe I want to turn it in right now or you can keep the log and put additional minutes on there as the week goes on. But when you're done there's a little button up here that says turn in. All you gotta do is click on that. And it's gonna take you back to Google Classroom. It's gonna ask you if for sure you wanna turn it in. And it's turning it in right now. And then you'll be able to see your work up here. So I can see that this has been turned in. Once it's turned in, you cannot make modifications to it. However, you can unsubmit it and then it will get back turned into you and you can change it. If you want to work on this as the week goes on, it will be under your work, but it will be not submitted. So it would look like this. Let's unsubmit it right now. So let's say I go in on Monday, I fill it in. I come back on Tuesday, I wanna to add to it. I could just click on this right here. So it'll stay in your Google Drive and it'll stay in your Google Classroom until you're ready to turn it in. If you have any questions, you can add your question on here, or you can email your teacher or anybody on the specialist team, and we'd be happy to help you. I hope this video was helpful for you, and I hope you stay very active. Make sure if you're leaving your house that you have permission, and make sure that somebody knows where you are. All right, stay active. Mm -hmm.